Hey guys, I'm Tesla, and in this tutorial for the Unreal Engine 4, we're going to use two music tracks and fade between them depending on where we are in the map. So this one is nice and easy, and I hope you enjoy it. Okay, so what we're going to need is some music files. We need two audio files, because we want to fade between one and then to the next one. So I'm going to use the starter content music, and I'm just going to create a copy of this one. So I'm going to right click it, create copy, I'm going to leave it named as that. But I'm going to open it up and change the pitch to 1.6. So it's going to sound completely different. And we're just going to drag both of these into the world. But with the, with the second one, we're going to turn off auto activate, otherwise they're both going to be playing at the same time. And we want to transition to this one. So to transition to it, we're going to um, use this box trigger that I've just set up here. And when we go up these stairs here, and walk around here, we're going to be in that new track. And when we jump out, we'll go back to normal. So to do that, we'll select the box trigger, open the level blueprint, and add a ref, uh, add a, a event, collision, begin overlap. And we're going to grab the first track, right click, add reference to it, drag this out, type in fade out, because we want this one to stop playing, and let's say the duration is going to be two seconds. We'll grab the second one, add a reference to this one, and fade in. And change the fade in duration to three seconds. So it sounds like this. So let's make it so when we leave the box trigger, we can begin to go back to that next track using the exact same process so we'll come into the level blueprint and all we have to do is select all these control W and break these links here and just swap them around and then change the targets okay and we need to select that box trigger once more add a event collision end overlap for when we leave the box trigger and it should the result should be like this Okay guys, that's it for this tutorial. If you are interested in one-on-one -on -one tutoring, please get in touch with my email in the video description. And make sure you stay subscribed for my future tutorials. Cheers guys.